my former pastor was uh, playing golf with the pastor of the largest church in the world, a million member church. And my pastor asked this pastor, um, how do you get your church praying? Like, how do you pray? What do you do? Because my pastor went to his church and the pastor just simply said to the congregation, let's pray. And my pastor said, it sounded like a waterfall all of a sudden just erupted as the entire church started to pray. Thousands of people praying at one time. And he said, how, how do you do that? How did you become a man of prayer? What do you do in your prayer life? He said, I just run the track. And he said, what track? And he said, the Lord's prayer. Our father who is in heaven, holy is your name, your kingdom come. Your will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. Lead us not into temptation or lead us away from temptation. Deliver us from the evil one. Yours is the kingdom, power, and glory forever, ever, and amen. Now, what Jesus told us not to do was take that prayer and just repeat it over and over and over and over and over. He said, he literally said, don't do that. What he did say was, this is how you pray. Those are seven categories of human need. Father in heaven, our need to have a relationship with God as our dad, as our father, as our Abba. Uh, holy is your name, that we worship him and we praise him. That's that's paternal need, uh, the praise need, his presence. Then priorities, your kingdom come, your will be done. And you just begin, you can stay there for so, for so long. Start praying for your pastor. Yeah. Pray for the leadership of the church. Pray for your church. Pray for your family, each kid by name, your friends, our city, the nation. Then give us this day our daily bread. Ask God for your personal needs. And then and notice how that's like number four on the list. You just don't start there. You start with your relationship with the Father, then his presence, then priorities, his kingdom come. Seek first the kingdom. All these things will be added to you. Your provision, which is give me this day my daily bread and ask specifically. Then forgive us our trespasses as we choose to forgive those who will trespass against us today. This is a morning prayer. This is... You know, getting ready for the day. Uh, clean your heart out of unforgiveness and bitterness. It'll clog the arteries of your spiritual heart. And then uh, protection, which is deliver, you know, lead us away from temptation, deliver us from the evil one. And then for yours is the kingdom, power, and glory. That's partnership. God, I know you've heard my prayers. I'm praising you for it again. Okay. That's how you run your track. And he said, when I'm done with the track, if I got time left, I run the track again. It's just like this track here, but our track is spiritual. All right. I hope that helps you. It has helped me over the years to pray consistently. I just run my track, the Lord's Prayer. God bless.